Hello, thanks for joining us today. I'm Christiana Cates. The Bethel Park Farmers Market on Corrigan Drive has opened for its first day of the season. Our Brianna McCullough got a chance to speak with Samantha Lee, the coordinator of this year's Farmers Market, about how the event was brought together this year. Reporting from the Bethel Park Farmers Market, Brianna McCullough, BPN, we are meeting with Sam Lee today, the coordinator of the Farmers Market. Hi, how are you? I'm good, thank good, you. Good. How long have you been the coordinator of the Farmers Market? So this is actually my first season. I started in March. Right, okay. How did you get into this line of work? Um, I've always done special events in some way. Um, and so, and I've been a resident of Bethel Park most of my life. So it was a natural fit when I saw the job come up. Great, perfect, perfect. And then um, how is this farmer's market going to be different from um, previous ones? So I don't have a lot to go off of as a worker, but as a consumer, I know that we have a lot of vendors this year, over 35 vendors. Each week we have over eight different food trucks. Um, we're trying to incorporate some new organic, gluten-free, vegan options for people. So I think that's what sets us apart from other markets, right, which is great. Exciting. Yeah. And what's your goal for this farmer's market in years to come? Uh, to hopefully expand, continue to do fun events. We have a Christmas in July on July 23rd and to continue to try to find new ways to incorporate fun activities into the into the farmer's market. So, All right. And what can people be excited about coming this year, right now, May 6th, 3 to 7 o'clock? What are people going to be looking forward to the most? What are you looking forward to? The most? Oh, geez. Well, it's going to be hard not to spend my paycheck here. There's so many great <laughs> options of um, beautiful flowers. Today we have Flora Park. Um, is providing an opportunity for kids to stop by, plant a flower for mom, make a nice card. So we're going to continue to have nice community events like that. The library this season, just ways to really engage the community all the way through children okay. and adults. Thank you so much for Thanks. stopping by with us. And this looks beautiful. Thank you so much. This is Sam Lee, everyone. Our Chelsea Perello is reporting at the Farmer's Market with the Vendor of the Week. I'm here today with Black and Gold Beef Jerky owner Michelle Ackerman, who is the featured vendor of the week at Bethel Park's Farmer's Market. Tell me a bit about your business to get started. Yeah, um, so Black and Gold Beef Jerky opened in February of this year. Um, currently, it is an online business mostly. Um, also currently at four retail locations across um, various counties. So um, we're also expanding here into Farmer's Market. So we'll be here once a month. What are the different types of foods you have here today? So our um, black and gold beef jerky is 10 flavors of brisket beef jerky. All of the meat comes from California um, and is freshly made. And I have 10 different flavors going from our original all the way to our Carolina Reaper, which is the spiciest. What inspired you to be a part of the Bethel Park Farmers Market and how long have you been participating? So this is our first year since we are a new small business, um, but living in South Park, I thought it was a great opportunity to get my name out there. And I've always heard great things about it, so wanted to make sure that we were a part of it. And what other days would you be at the farmer's market? So we will be here the first Tuesday of every month. And are there any social media platforms that we could find you on? Yeah, absolutely. So our website is www.blackandgoldbeefjerky.com. Um, our Facebook and Instagram are also Black and Gold Beef Jerky. Right. So really easy to find us. Okay. <laughs> and reporting from the Bethel Park Farmers Market, Chelsea Perello, BPN News. Be sure to check out the Bethel Park Farmers Market every Tuesday at Corrigan Drive. Thank you for joining us for BPN News. Have a good rest of your day.